Hi, and welcome to Wrong Way. And today, I'm gonna tell you about eight reasons why I love small electric unicycles, and in particular, the Kingsong 14D. So, let me tell you more about it. Wrong Way. And first up, also huge thanks to you guys. We reached 60,000 subscribers, so, Thanks a lot, thanks to my patrons, thanks to my YouTube members. If you want to get a fun badge in your comment section and let me find you easier there, then uh, um, become a YouTube member, I guess, if you, if you want that. Huge thanks uh, for the support and let's get into the video. Also, there will be a part two to this video where I will talk about the negatives of small wheels. So subscribe if you don't want to miss out on that. The first reason why I love those small electric unicycles is, of course, the form factor. They are a lot more portable, easier to store pretty much anywhere next to a table, in a coffee shop, uh, on a tram, bus, etc, etc. So I do like just the smallness of this machine. I think that electric wheels are the smallest, most capable micro-mobility devices, and a small wheel like that demonstrates this pretty well. The next reason that is quite connected to form factor is lightness. I don't want to always take a veteran Sherman up two flights of stairs if I don't have to. So if I'm going to a location where I'm not sure if there are some stairs involved, or I am sure that there are some stairs involved, then I'd rather take this than my veteran Sherman Max. Another thing that I love about small electric unicycles, and this is actually to the Kingsong 14D in particular, is the trolley handle slash handle slash lift switch combo. Everything in one. So we have a trolley handle to push this thing around. Really convenient, locks in place. It's not the sturdiest, but it's definitely sturdy enough. And then if you put it down, you can use it as a lift switch. And even if it's erected, you can still use it as a lift switch. So this is just so seamless for integrating this thing if you need to, you know, carry it up some stairs or just, you know, disengage it, put it somewhere. It's just so convenient in those everyday city scenarios. Another thing that I love about the small electric wheels is that they're just so inconspicuous compared to their bigger brothers and sisters. If you ride those things around on a why do cars have to be loud? If you ride this thing on a sidewalk really slowly, it doesn't really like gather a lot of attention. If you trolley it into a coffee shop or a grocery store, nobody really minds it and sees it as much as a veteran Sherman. And if you just want to use your EUC as a last mile solution to not gather too much attention, I think a small EUC is really good for that. <laughs> A thing that I like about the Kingsong 14D in particular is also safety. And this wheel in this weight class and price category is the only one that has all of the six safety features I mentioned. First of all, passive cell balancing, that's what InMotion doesn't have. A connection between motherboard and battery, that's what Bigot doesn't have. A motherboard temperature sensor, decent water resistance, however no IP rating. Alarms and tilt back when overpowering the wheel or reaching a too high speed. And da, 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 da. of course fuses. Oh, actually there's seven things. And a cold charge port. so rainy outside cleaning the lens and I think in a small wheel this is particularly important because you will be taking this wheel into like some more crowded areas and I think especially in those instances you want to have something that is more safe now a thing that is missing is still a smart BMS and an IP rating well I guess I'll talk about that in my video about things that I do not like about this wheel Another thing that I love about small wheels is the ease of riding. And one reason of having this wheel next to my veteran Sherman is that I can teach people a little bit easier on this wheel than on the veteran Sherman Max. When it comes to learning new skills, teaching people, especially people that don't have the muscles yet, uh, you know, strong enough that you need for wheeling. I don't know which ones those are, they don't hurt me anymore. <laughs> 
<laughs> then it's a lot cooler to have a smaller wheel that is a lot more manageable than a heavyweight wheel. And even if you are already like strong enough to use a bigger wheel, sometimes <laughs> uh, you might still want to go back to this. So it's not really like you outgrow a small wheel. You can have them alongside each other. Let's try. Uh, almost, let's try again. Oh yeah. Another thing, and that's the seventh reason why, oh, I need to change gloves, I like small wheels, is that they're still very capable for what they are. Now, granted, they're not as powerful as their 20 or 25, 30 kilogram car counterparts, but compared to a scooter, they, they have still plenty of torque to go uphill with a range and reliability that is actually unheard of in this price and weight category. And the last thing on my list is price. Now, I did get this EUC actually for myself. I bought it for a special price, but even so, this EUC new costs 900 euro. And this is a huge gap to the V12s, V11s, S22s of this world. So if you're thinking about getting an EUC, it is actually not a bad idea to start with something small because then you can train C and after a while you can get a second one. <laughs> <laughs> or you can just switch this one for a bigger one. I think just spending less money or even getting a used EUC as your entry point to this um, wheel world uh, is a good thing. So yeah, price is not bad on those things. All right. So with that said, those are my eight reasons why I like small electric unicycles. And if I forgot about any, please let me know in the comments. And if you're still here, leave a like on the video Subscribe to see more content like this. I'll see you in the next video. See you soon.